Rick is the secondary main character of the Made in Abyss series. Rick himself is also a piece of ancient technology from the bottom layer of the Abyss, his robotic body perfectly mimicking that of a human child. Having lost any recollection of the past after saving Rico, he decides to join her on a journey to the deepest part of the pit, both to regain his memory and find Rico's lost mother. Keep in mind that some of the list are observations and summer facts, others are useless things. Most of the info comes from a website like Wiki, and others come from a fan-based website. That being said, here are the lists for Reg, the pressure of the abyss. As a robot, Reg has an extendable arms. His hands can reach up to 40 meters or 130 feet. He also uses it as a protective web like cables to protect Rico when they are traveling in the abyss. Reg has superhuman strength. He was able to lift a large stone plate and even lift a large boulder with one hand to crush Bondred with it. His durability is not match. Even Ozen, who was introduced as the strongest character, couldn't break him. Even though he feels pain as Ozen pummels him, his body is actually unharmed by the attack. Reg's main power is the incinerator which blasts anything in its path. He can make it wider or make it thinner. His weapon can inflict wounds that cannot be healed. That is why it was the perfect weapon to kill Mitty, since Mitty is an immortal regenerator. His incinerator is later speculated to be Sparagmos, the origin returning light, which is all but confirmed when it clashes with bond roots on Sparagmos and two blasts deflect and cancel each other. This powerful weapon comes at cost. Reg will always fall unconscious 10 minutes after using the incinerator. He cannot be woken up for 2 hours afterwards. Also, the number of shots is limited. After Reg uses all of them up, he likely dies. He can refill them by absorbing large amounts of electricity, with a max capacity shown to be somewhere around 20. Reg bleeds, if damaged, though it is unclear how the blood loss would affect him. The blood quickly solidifies like metal and seals the wound. Since he is not an organic life form, he is immune to most of the dangers of the Abyss. This includes the Ascension Curse that has sent many Delvers to their early graves. His durability is something else, being able to withstand fire, resist drilling, slashing, and even blunt force. Even his soft, silicon-like skin is almost impervious to damage or penetration. His navel is the thinnest part of his skin, and can thus be penetrated far more easily than the rest of him. He has a very keen nose. He recognizes Nat before he removes his hood, and he is able to tell that Maruk is a boy because of how he smells. Since he doesn't remember his real name, Rico names him Reg, after her old dog. It is revealed he was known as Reg even before he came to the surface. I would like to thank these people for giving me positive comments. As a small creator, it really helps build up the confidence and create a new content. So thank you guys for your passive comments. So thank you guys and peace out.